I know what you're thinking. Kim, you should be decluttering your closet right now. Well, I figured I would move backwards to forwards. Today I'm going to the thrift store. It's on our summer bucket list. Like I, you know, I just gotta follow that thing, right? I'm bringing Avelina and it's gonna be a girl's day adventure. Who knows what we're gonna find? We're going to the red, white, and blue th local thrift store near me. Last time we went, it was massive. There was a ton to explore, so let's find some treasures. We made it inside. It's quite busy today. Wait, I'm gonna check out the artwork first. I'm gonna check out the artwork first. I'm looking for some artwork for our dining room slash, remember that lion painting I almost got for Wentworth's room? It was beautiful. Ooh, that's actually a nice one. I'm looking for something way bigger. Oh my gosh, this is probably perfect. It's Sydney, Australia for the kids playroom come on that's a gem already found a gem 30 seconds in already found a gem oh i'm loving the colors okay so i should probably explain the top things i'm looking for i'm in my barbie core era <laughs> i'm just kidding but pink stuff i'm into that oh my gosh i used to have a humongo one of these tell me if you used to have one too i feel like at one point that you know we all went through that phase i mean depending on how old you are right but I'm also looking for some staple pieces, some neutrals. Oh, is this it? Did I find it here for $12.99, this frame? Fit? Oh, come on, that's a gem. Some, my kids are probably gonna try to talk me out of that one. This one's, he ooh, that, oh, look at them. It's like the brother and sister from Mary Poppins. That's a staple movie. By the way, is this $80? Are they nuts? I mean, they're not that nuts because that frame alone is well over a hundred. Pabo, I'm gonna sift through these and then I'll let you know if I find anything. Oh my gosh, I've been trying to find like an antique something. Is this embroidered? Okay, well, another gem. Check this. Surely this needs to go somewhere. Okay, so my toxic trait is buying a bunch of artwork that I love and having nowhere to put it. So I actually need someone to talk me out of it. Oh look, it's Sarasota. Even Avelina found a gem. Six dollars for this? If you felt it, you'd be like, what? I love Lady and the Tramp, but not six dollars. Is red tag on sale? <laughs> Everything's red tag over here. That's That was funny, come on. Ooh, an antique. Hey, it's the Macarena. This guy's rolling with his slow jams. Avelina was not a fan of that one. Ooh, some planes. See the prop, ooh, ooh, hold on, hold on. I think I see, is this beachy or is that a turkey? I think that's beach-esque. Not really the vibe I'm looking for. Everything's just, ooh, London. We're traveling the world over here. Oh my word, someone put together a puzzle. What is this, a 5,000 piece puzzle? Hey, shout out, Nova Scotia. Look how beautiful that is. It's really great quality and it's only $13. It's just insane. Should I get, the, it's too small for my dining room, but it is beautiful and I love it. A world traveler was definitely decluttering their house. You guys, New Zealand right here. What are we gonna find next? Oh, it's my grandma's house. Someone pulled that out and honestly respect. I have one that I wanna show you. Just a few more to sift through. Where's that? Virginia, shout out. Okay, this one I wanted to see. This is beautiful. I think the frame is just too clunky for what, but it's like, that's part of the beauty of it too. Oh, I don't know. It's only $30, it's crazy. <laughs> I thought this was a statue of David, but it's Poseidon and the tag is perfectly placed. I always come here to look for a grandfather clock. Oh, that's act. This is pretty cool, Avelina. Do you like that one? I want a grandfather clock that goes on the wall. Oh, wait, is that one? No. Wait, yes. Yes, it is. Peek inside. Oh, it doesn't have the innards. Oh, that's a shame. It's like inscribed and everything. What does it say? My sweetie pie, 25 years. Maybe on my 25th anniversary, Alex will get me a wall grandfather clock. Actually, is this what we, we've been looking for? It's only 60 bucks. I'm on, oh yeah, we'll look for a blender. I'm on my, ooh, I think someone was going through the breakers. Someone was going through their stuff and this was their no pile. Look how cute that is. Can you find out what? What tags are on sale? <gasps> Ooh, preppy! Malibu. This was definitely someone's no pile. <gasps> Ooh, the detail. 
Anyway, this is beautiful. Oh my word, and it's Talbots for $6. Ooh, it's a petite. So am I. Ooh, Ralph Lauren. Check it, Ralph Lauren for $8. Turtlenecks and Florida just don't go well together. What the heck, I came down this aisle. Oh, ooh, University of Virginia, shout out. Did they have a lot of no's or am I just in like the best section ever? Okay, what I wanted to say is I came down this aisle. Avelina told me there's a blender, which we are in need of one. But this is the men's section and I'm trying to maybe dress like Chessie. And she has like, you know, this vibe happening, but not as thick. You know what I mean? Like a nice blue and white stripe. So I'm going to check out this area. This one, sadly, not my size. I don't even know what size I am, but I know this is not it. Uh, also too thick. I have to pass on this plastic blender. I'm sure I can get it cheaper from Kohl's. 25 bucks. Come on. I like to check the outsides of aisles, like the end of aisles. Because Ooh, Newport. Shout out. Where's that New Hampshire? Woodridge. That's got to mean something. Anyway, this is where people put items back. They like try them on because this thrift store doesn't have a, a dressing room. This is really thick. $25. This spider has probably got to be a good brand, right? Okay, I've been waiting to take a peek on this Christmas section. Oh my gosh, that Christmas tree right up there. It is probably animated. Do we see anything else? This is probably animated too. He looks pretty cute. Oh, no batteries. How about this? Try me. Oh, nothing. Let's see. Oh, success. That is a bop. Christmas is right around the corner, but you know what comes next? Halloween. Oh, hey, check it. Cupcake liners. That's a screaming deal. Last time they had a ton of these. I can read Fancy Nancy books. I think I'm going to grab some for Meredith. She's loving Fancy Nancy. Made it to the shoes. I'm looking for some colorful ones. The, well, I'm looking for sandals. These are cracking me up. What brand is this? Oh my, are you joking me? Right now, the first thing I pick up is a Cole Haan shoe for $15. Do you even know? Okay, well, what size is this? Looks like my size, if you ask me. I was kind of laughing. I found some Toms, a wedge, a Tom wedge. But there's a bunch of colorful shoes over here and they're looking pretty good. I'm gonna peek through these. I'm trying to find a nice neutral sandal too. These are really cute too. I don't think they're my size. They look really small, but yellow tag, I think is 50% off. I can't even remember. I just found out. Blue tones I'm trying to look for. And then also green. I found a pair of green sandals on uh, thread up that I almost ordered this morning. <laughs> I was like, I need to cool it. These are really cute too. I've never thought of shoe as not flattering, but uh, I don't think, I don't know. Actually, the more I look at them, the more I love them. I'm going to think on these. Okay, stop. Bass, these are bass shoes for $10. I didn't even look at the size. I'm just awestruck at everything. My shoes have like crusty sand in them. It's fashion. Look how cute, I like a good wedge. Little wedge though, not too tall. I don't know about this buckle on, on the ankle. I'm needing a shoe refresh. My shoes grew. My shoes grew, my feet grew this past pregnancy again. I'd love to find a good purple shoe or a yellow shoe, something comfortable. I, are these all pumps? Did I come to the right area? Like, look how darling these are. Hold on, let's put, oh, not a pump. Also, not my size. Well, is it? It might be my size. That pointy toe always throws me off. I'll probably never wear them, but I would love to. I'm pretending to be busy while I'm waiting for someone to go through their cart. She has a lot of gems. I think she's gonna put back the stuff she doesn't like, but I might like it. Fingers crossed. She's almost done. And she's out of here. Okay, these are her nose. Look how sweet these are. Linen pants. This is on my must have list, right? Oh, it's a small. Okay, that might not be good for me. They're $10, new with tags. I'm gonna give these a try and they have pockets. I feel like one of those people at a casino, not that I've ever really been to a casino, but there's gotta be people. Wait, wasn't there a sweatshirt here? She took it, she loved it. What did it say on it? Something New Hampshire? Anyway, 
Those are really cute too. Nike's green tag, half off. Anyway, the people at the casinos, they wait for the slot machines so people leave and then they strike, right? Okay, well, she didn't put these back on the hanger very well, but this is darling, super boho, super springy, summery. It's not spring, but every day is spring in Florida. That's how you find the good stuff, right? Okay, so this is a USA t-shirt. Love America and all that good stuff. Two bucks, what a gem. I'll never wear that. Talk me out of that, okay? And then this is Darling too, but I don't love the texture. And then this is a solid basic. Oh my word, do they have all the brand names here? Are these Clarks? Clarks, is this a joke? These are nice and cushioned. Dark blue, probably not on sale. I don't even think it's my size. I have to figure this stuff out. I can't even read it if I wanted to. Does that say 12? Jackpot. Who's got some new Clarks? She's got new Clarks. Okay, that's enough. Actually, I found my section. What is this? Something suede. I've been seeing this brand around too. I found my section. It's like sandals. Sandals, colorful sandals. So I'm gonna look through here too. Are these Birkins? I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of those, but I am a huge fan of Ooh, these I can dig it Aerosols, I just like the orange. I think that's great. Also some toms over here. What's with the peep of peekaboo tom? Ooh, I like this. These are Clark's too. I think I'm just an old lady at heart I can dig it. Ooh, look at these too Not a fan of like the thong sandal worth just thongs in general I found some yellow toms. I think they're men's, but I don't care. Like, does it matter? No, they're a little big. So I think loafers are back in style. Not that I ever took them out of style. Ooh, that's got a heel on it. Anyway, this brand with the umlau, never heard of it, but I bet it's pricey just for uh, 12 bucks here. Oh my gosh, Coach, that's hilarious. And these are cute too, but this is my kind of shoe over here. Oh my gosh, another Coach, how funny. I like this sandal style. Make it look like I'm about to go on a hike, but I don't actually go on a hike, you know? <laughs> These look pretty sweet. They feel like they're made of wool. That's the brand. And I don't know, I kind of wish they fit me, but they don't. Also found some hiking shoes. Perfect. Oh my gosh, right next to another pair of Toms. Cute. Pair of white Toms but it's missing its buddy. This is just asking for trouble, right? White Toms. Oh, I actually like these. I found my new favorite section. I don't know what brand this is. Eastland. Oh look, Christmas Toms. Another gem, Kate Spade loafers. Oh, they're not my size. What a shame, but also they're $35. So I'm wondering if I can pull a Cinderella and kind of like force them on. Oh my gosh, perfect fit. It's a perfect fit. I was looking at this one and I thought, oh, that's a little clunky. And then I saw this and said, oh, that's beautiful. Isn't she a beaut? Still in the shoes. I, there's just so much to explore here. Nike's Goodwill does not have this selection. What is this, Asics or something? I don't know much about anything, but this is Under Armour. Those, like, look at the bottom of those. Brand spanking new. We got some Vans up in here. What are these, Nike? Is this a joke? Okay, well, I might be going home with a pair of purple sneakers or pink ones. What the heck is that? Skechers? I'm not even showing you. I am the worst right now. Good news, the purple ones fit and these fit too, but I don't know if I need that many sneakers. They have so many. Oh my gosh, these like velvet pink New Balances. These are super cute too. Another pair of Toms. Are those cats? Oh, it's like the, the mean cat or ugly cat, whatever the heck. Look, mermaid core, you found it! We found a match. It's like Cinderella. I'm pretty sure I just ordered a pair of New Balances that look similar to this from Thread Up. Otherwise, I would snatch those in a heartbeat. How much are these? Ooh, 20 bucks. I don't think I paid that much <laughs> on Thread Up. Probably for the best. Oh my gosh, what? If these didn't look like bowling shoes, I'd. I don't know how to finish that sentence. I would buy them. I would I buy them because they look like bowling shoes. I like them. I would keep on walking. How about that? My brain cannot compute. Oh my gosh, they found the Cinderella pair. Okay, now I have to try it on. <laughs> what do we think? Am I this woman who can pull off a white sneaker? Yes. 
so far I have a new shoe wardrobe in my cart. My current white sneakers are looking a little drab, uh, plus they're probably from the 1940s, and I found these Reeboks. I don't know, they kind of look a little discolored, but for 15 bucks or 12 bucks, however much they are, pretty nice. And to think, I almost didn't go down the shoe aisle. I found so many gems. I'm gonna have to pare it down at the end of the day. All right, now on to purses. Not huge on purses. I am huge on color these days, but also trying to be neutral. Ooh, like classic, you know what I mean? $8 for that? Oh, but it doesn't have a shoulder strap, though, so that's out for me, but that is beautiful. They also have backpacks here. I'm just gonna take you along this wall until I see something that catches my eye. I feel like last time I came, they had a ton more purses, but there's a ton of people here today, so they picked out all the good stuff <laughs> before I came. A weekender bag, it looks like, down there. All right, nothing I like. But wait, there's more. Oh my gosh, someone found a recorder. Is this a lunchbox? A cooler? Oh, now they're speaking my language. Oh, are these all coolers? I gotta, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> this can be dangerous. You know how much I love a good cooler. Do you hear that recorder? <laughs> oh, I love that. Ooh, backpacks. Oh, Hannah Montana backpack. I can buy myself flowers. Hannah Montana is the best. Oh, well, maybe one of these? What's happening here? I like this. It's from the sack, and I really like that. I wish it had a uh, shoulder strap. Ooh, this is a nice one too, and it does have a shoulder strap. Cute. I am looking for a wolf t-shirt today, okay? So keep your eyes peeled for that. That's an adult with a recorder, by the way, <laughs> if you're wondering. Oh yeah, last time they had a ton of beer, Bradley. I'm wondering what this is down here. Is this another lunchbox? Heck yeah, it is. Oh, and then I'm like gravitated toward this stuff. I don't know why I like Vera Bradley so much. Oh, grocery bags? Oh, get me out of here. Let's find, let's find a good grocery bag. I'm a sucker for a grocery bag. Hold on for just a moment. I was looking at this one. It's really the only one I'm interested in. Trying to find a price, you guys. It comes in a clump. All of these for $2.99. Look, one of them is zippered. What, what is happening in here? Got all kinds of bags for $2.99. You can't even get one bag at TJ Maxx for $2.99. Some cake stands here, lots of champagne flutes and all that good stuff, glasses. Oh, I see Hershey. Does that say Hershey Park? Hershey chocolate. Oh, that is a gem and a half. $4, are they nuts? I mean, it is quality and I'm sure brand new, it's like 25. Oh, there's a match. There's two of them. I feel like they need to be together. This caught my eye. This would be great for like a trifle, right? Look how pretty that is. I don't make them often and I just use my cake stand upside down. But maybe if I bought this, I would make it more often because it looks nicer than my cake stand. Okay, I'll think about it. I'll think on it. It's always nice to come here if you're in between getting like dish sets or if you're looking for a new one or you need dishes, whatever the case may be. I wish I would have known about this. Like look how beautiful those are. Six dollars, a little steep. You can find a better deal than that. But you get what I'm trying to say. Ooh, platters too. Endless. Look, it comes in a whole set. You get a platter and all that crap. Is that a tea set or something? I don't drink tea, but if I did, maybe if I bought that set, I'd be more inclined to drinking tea. This looks like the set I grew up with. I'm pretty sure this is the set I grew up with, the, the Corral. Cor am I saying that correctly? Probably not but you get what I'm trying to say. You can have all the nostalgia. Hold on, water bottles. Ooh, what'd you find? I wanna show you. <gasps> Hold on, what is this backpack? Ooh, oh. Vera Bradley, that looks real if nice. You like it, you should get it oh I'm my gosh, how many mouths have been on that? Oh, oh, <laughs> you're just blowing. Really yeah, I used to play this when I was a kid. All right. That's a yes. This bag is not part of it. This bag, it, I'll take it. Thank okay. you so much. This is a Dude, fantastic in, little. An Elmo? Oh, from Meredith? No. Oh, rude. Did you get anything for the little ones? You said that I could get my ears pierced. Oh, cute. Two dollars. They can't be real for two bucks. Bucks. Yeah, grab them. Oh, well, I didn't. We need Barbies. I need to get some for Meredith. Right. And I know you like... Ooh, what's inside? <gasps> Ooh, steal of a deal. Three bucks. Um, This to decorate them. Ooh, no. cool. Sunglass. That's on our um, 
summer bucket list. Yes. Decorate sunglasses. And Look what I found, a shaved ice machine. Wait, do you, is this electric? Boogie, woogie, woogie? Or do we have to, is it a pumper? Look at this, I'm pretty sure this is like a vintage set. I mean, just by looking at it, I'd say 70s. It's a whole dang set, you guys. Oh, someone's gonna be so happy when they find that. Look, it's a stand-up lantern. Oh wait, a witch? A lantern pan? Oh, this is cool, a stand-up jack-o'-lantern. Should I get this, you guys? We can get a stand-up witch or a whatever that the heck this is for four bucks. Okay, that's a yes. You really, you really talked me into that one. Oh my heck, you guys, my phone is full. I just deleted 500 videos, so it might let me take like five minutes more. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Taco night, we got some kind of witch, some kind of scale. All right, I gotta get the important stuff. Look at this beautiful cheese board. It even comes with the knife attached. That's old school. With the chain too, like literally attached. <laughs> How funny is this? We are, uh, is this exactly the size that we have and are needing? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna call Alex. They've got some really nice exercise equipment here. They've got the ab scissor. Oh, you know I gotta try that out. Lots of funky fresh furniture up in here and juvie spoon. I don't know what that is, but I know that brand is not cheap. Ooh, wow, I wish I would have slowed down for two seconds to Google what the heck it was. I am kicking myself. It's a walker, something I'm actually in the market for. Unbelievable. This will go down to one of my biggest regrets from the thrift Check store. Check out these. Is this for like physical therapy? Masseuse, massages. They have more furniture over here too. Um, baby, That's for a baby, some chairs over here. I've been looking at dining room chairs with this detail. Uh, not the yellow seat, but it's a good find. They have a ton of games. Oh, I'm seeing this Kids Against Maturity. It's like um, Adults Against Humanity or something like that. I think that's a good card game for the kids. And then out of the corner of my eye, I saw this. A Vest Werewolf. We should all be wolves for Halloween. Oh my gosh, look, Peppa down there. I think they have a lot of costumes here. I'm gonna look for some princess dresses for Meredith, she's really into that. They have a ton more too, those darts. Okay, I'm looking for Barbie's board books. Not looking for that, but oh my heavens. I am looking for Barbie's. I think a ton of them are up front. Like this place is riddled with all kinds of toys. Oh, maybe I'll find a walker for the baby. What is this, a bull? Look how crazy that is. All kinds of houses. Oh, that's a little scoot along. That's fun too, you got this. <gasps> Look, a little boho. Oh, Eleanor would like that. That's really cute. And all kinds of baby dolls. My kids find all kinds of creative ways to play with baby dolls. Like, give them a makeover. <laughs> Found some gems, had to share. If you had to guess what brand this is, Avelina. I mean, what are these straps? It is, it's Lily Pulitzer. These are gonna like break off the second I put it on my body. I don't know if it's meant for like to, as a strap, but it's so dang cute. But the thing with Lily Pulitzer stuff, they price it like crazy, 35 bucks. So cute, but I'm gonna pass. Anyway, I found this mod cloth. It, I don't think it will fit me, but you know I'm gonna try this stuff on. Look how dang cute this is. I've heard of this brand before. It's yellow, is yellow half off? 30 bucks. Ooh, it might be my lucky day. And then just this for fun. I wanted to show you because it's really pretty. So I am looking for linen. Linen is the, linen is the fabric of my life. And uh, that is not linen. I don't know. I have really a hard time looking for pants. Like pants that fit me, pants that look good. But I was watching someone this morning and I swear everything she tried on, even if it was like five sizes bigger, she made it work. And I was like, what the heck? Anyway, I'm looking at these wondering, they look really high rise. I might give those a try. I wore really tight leggings today for a reason. Skin tight, a second layer of my skin, I like to say. Those aren't linen, but I'll give those a try. They're from Talbot, so I know it's good material. Linen is the fabric of my life. That's what I was trying to say. These are a stretch. I just want to be comfortable and fashion. <laughs> <gasps> linen, I found them. <gasps> Hello. It's an extra large, but could I pull it off? Finally found a linen pant. No, hers had a drawstring. That's how she was able to make it work. So if I find one with a drawstring, oh, that's not linen though, I don't think. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna keep looking and then give you a heads up. 
Okay, I found a couple. I'm pretty sure this is extra small, but I think it's vanity sizing, so I'm gonna give that a try. And then I found this one. I think these might be a little better. They're less white and more of a cream, but uh, it's whatever. I probably will just try them on right here in the aisle. Ooh, these are nice too. Why doesn't everything have an elastic waistband and pockets? You can tell this is vintage. And now we have proof. No big deal, just me walking around trying to find a mirror. I think these are too tight. I would like them a little looser. I can't get the extra small past my hips, my birthing hips, but these, oh, someone's gonna love these. I might have better luck with these. I like to look at the other colors too. Cause you never know what you're gonna find like these. Oh my gosh. These might be perfect. Look, Alfred Dunner again. Alfred Dunner is a stunner. The other ones, I don't think I tried on. I think I, no, I think I left them. I don't even know. So I'll give those a whirl. Pants are just so tricky and I actually need to find a mirror. I got too discouraged, like trying those white pants on and not being able to see them fully. These are great too. A little, a little button detail down here. <laughs> oh, that's funny. You know, bright colors. I'm pretty sure that's in right now. Ooh, this is linen too. Doesn't have a drawstring. So I think that's going to be out for me. Ooh, these are really comfortable. I feel like another place I might be able to find some nice linen pants or maybe the pajamas. Just because they feel so comfortable, people might think they're pajamas or some pajamas might actually be linen. Ooh, hey, who's this from? If it's Alfred Dunner, I'm buying a lottery ticket. Oh, I don't know. It's like sewn. But for $4? Some nice bright yellow? Didn't I, did I say I was coming in here for neutrals? Made it to some white tops and I'm just looking for something flowy, something casual. Watch, I pick out something that looks like this. You know, I don't, you can't, I don't really have anything in mind. Ooh, Columbia, that's nice. I like this style and I like that it doesn't have a collar. Ooh, I like this one too. I, I'm not into the peekaboo shoulder. Ooh, this is really nice, but it's thick. Nice brands here I've noticed too last time. I kind of like this too, but I don't know. I feel like it might be too thick. I don't know, I don't know who I am. And the problem is you can be anyone you want to be at the thrift store. And I just go ham. Like, what do I, will I ever wear this? I don't know. Probably not. I'm going to put it back. Oh, but I like it. Ooh, loft. Okay, see? But a stain. Another thing you have to be careful about. Ooh, J. Crew. That's my mood. But also Tommy Bahama. You know what I mean? Like, that's my vibe lately. Just nice and chill. I like that. This is really beautiful. This is a crop top, kind of. Ooh, and then this one. Oh, this feels beautiful feels luxurious looking through white tops a lot of this brand looking through white tops ugh, it's one of my least favorite things to do on planet earth that's why i don't have any white shirts really that i wear Ooh, this could be like that's a cute little tunic if it was five inches longer and actually a dress i'd be all over it oh i need to look in the dress section too i'll go there next maybe i looked through the pink i found some a lot of j crew and ll bean and all that stuff this one looks really nice. It's unbranded. I wonder if it's like an Amazon type of thing. I don't know, not really my style. I don't do a lot of stripes. Ooh, I feel like this is my style. Coral Bay, heck yes it is. It seems so hot though. Why do they make beachy themed shirts so dang thick? <gasps> Two piece sets. Oh yes, and I do want to check out the skirts. I want like a lilac. In my head, I, I have something exactly like what I want, and I bet you I won't find anything near it, but I'll find other stuff. Ooh, green. I would like to have some green stuff too. Liz Claiborne, you know, she knows what she's doing when she's creating these things. Also, the hats up here. Ooh, this is dang cute too. Oh, it's Sheen. Sheen. This one's for Cynthia. Ooh, I, I like this one. Actually, I like the pillowy shoulder on that the sleeve i don't know what they call that i'm horrible with fashion Ooh, it's the same brand which one do we like more i kind of like the green 
Oh, but it has a collar. Not my favorite, but it is new with tags, so I'll try it on. Oh, another one. Maybe they donated it. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. So someone got so many of them. I was like, get these out of my house. Oh, another one. That's pretty funny. I don't know what's happening here. If this brand is like a swimsuit cover-up or what. It's like two inches too short. Oh, yeah, I think it is a swimsuit cover-up. This is darling. How much is it? I mean, we are going on vacation again. I'm just saying. And that one's new with tags. Okay, what's happening here? All right, well, cute. Not for me, but maybe for you. Yes, now this is the reason I come thrift store shopping. This is it find. Look, sewing. Oh my gosh, if I had a sewer in my life, I would get that for them. I don't. And I don't know if they would wear it. <laughs> but I did find some really nice, like, blue and white. Isn't that darling? It's beautiful. I don't have a lot of shirts, like, to wear, you know? Ooh, that's made well. Not for me. It is a yellow tag, so I'll keep it here for you. All right, I made it to the skirts. Oh, gosh. Ser I'm at this thrift store again where everything I touch, it falls off the hanger. See, I didn't even touch that when it fell off the hanger. That's a cute skirt, though. All right, orange isn't my vibe, but I'm going to look through the purple. Well, that was short-lived. Maybe they'll have more. I'm looking for a pattern. Maybe I'm looking for something too specific. Ooh, these are cute. Are these all jean skirts? I heard these are coming back. Not for me, I'll tell you what. Ooh, maybe it's something like this. I have something like this though, so. Ooh, a Liz Claiborne. This is beautiful too. I have a lot of white. Ooh, what size is that? This is really sweet too. I think it's too long for me. Maxi skirts don't do me any favors. Just because I'm so short, they kind of drowned me. What am I in sweaters now? Oh my gosh, do I need one? No, but do I want it? You know the answer. What is this, fur? All right, black skirts, boring, 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 boring. I should probably look in the short section. Like shorts, I need some shorts. Not just that I'm short, because I'm only like five foot. Ooh, a nice polka dot. Oh, what's this? Okay, this is cute. 70s vibe, we can do better. Ooh, more purples. Nah, not good enough. Ooh, this one has birds. Ooh, I kind of dig this one. I don't think this will fit me, but it's really pretty. Also, only three bucks. I'll give it a try. Ooh, also this one. How dang cute that is. Have you heard of something called quiet luxury or old money or something like that? I can't really remember. But I was looking through that on my Pinterest board too. And that's a whole look. It's basically like classic, neutral style. Ooh, this is feels nice. Ooh, it's loft. This might be something. I came to the pants. I found this nice random linen pant. I'm going to give that a try. And then I like the seersucker style. This is J. Crew. Uh, my gosh, it must be a tall or uh, my five feet is really showing. These are beautiful too. I love the fabric of this. It might fit like a second layer of skin slash sausage casing, but I don't think I'll ever wear it. Should I give them a try? Might as well. I'll see. I don't think I own a single pair of jeans. Oh my gosh, the bane, the bane of my existence. And it's so hard to find jeans these days without rips and like fading in it, like intentional fading. Like, are you just, I don't want this garbage. If that's your style, that's awesome. The, I don't even look, oh, what a waste of my time. I did find these though, randomly. I don't think they're gonna fit, but I don't even know what size they are but I don't know what size I am, so I'm in good company. Also, oh my gosh, check. Laundry day. I have way too much in my cart. I don't have time for this. Oh my gosh, are you joking? These are amazing. I found all the gems in the blue section over here. What are these? Oh, not my size, but a total find. So, no, nah, that's not the best. Sometimes you have to feel it, you know? This would be like old money or new luxury or whatever the heck it's called. Quiet luxury. Something like that. A lot of black and whites too. A lot of light blues and neutrals. I did find a ton of rompers over here. Ooh. Uh, I don't think that will fit me, but that looks funky and fresh and fun. This could be really cute too. The first row of dresses is riddled with people. This one, not so much. This is really pretty, but too long. 
I told you, I'm only five foot, so it's gonna swamp me. Blues, I think I have a ton of blues in my cart. You guys should see it, it's pretty much all I have. Not intentional, didn't come for the blues. Ooh, lemons. I would like a green. My must have for a dress. Oh, by the way, I found something from Altered State. Actually, this is really pretty. I don't know what the heck size is this? 13 to 14, is that a kid's size? I'm gonna try it on anyway. <laughs> or is this more my size? Ross. Oh, that's really pretty too. That's from Old Navy. Okay, oh, pink. Ah, shice. I'm gonna go through the pink. I think the other side of the dresses, oh my gosh, <gasps> are we dressing up as, what's this movie? A League of Their Own. Oh my gosh, can we dress up like that for Christmas? Not Christmas, Halloween? That would be fun. Have you ever seen A League of Their Own? It's a good one. Oh my gosh, what was that? Ooh, this feels vintage and beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna go through the maxi dresses real quick. Wait, a maxi dress, and then of course I pull out a short one. How funny, that's kind of like the, oh, whoa, look at that jumper. This is kind of like the pretty woman dress, kind of, not really. Browns aren't my thing. I thought I wanted to try it out, but turns out it didn't work for me. Actually, this is beautiful. Oh, it's the high-low romper deal, not for me. What am I in the romper section? I gotta get out of here. I don't, I, ooh, 4th of July. Oh my gosh, makes me want a hot dog real bad. All right, I got vetoed. It's not a 4th of July fit. Your kiss is on my lips. Oh wow, Space Jam. Wait, what is that? I don't know, some kind of alien. A wedding dress. Ooh, this is not beautiful. I, I didn't see the bottom. Okay, well, looks like I don't want any of these. None, yuck, ugh, hate it. But I'll just keep on looking. <laughs> Actually, this looks really nice. Speaking of wedding dresses, we have arrived. Oh, look at, ooh, this is, I could wear this as a nightie. This is so comfortable. Whoever got married in that, I bet they're still married. Because your kiss, your kiss. Ooh, pinks, <gasps> pinks, you guys. It's Barbie core era. We're doing it. We're doing some good stuff over here. Ooh, a jumper. See, this is cupcakes and cashmere. This is cashmere. Should I give it a try? Fine. Okay, these are evening gowns. Ooh, a purple. I like a good purple evening gown. Have you heard of that purple drink that's going around? You guys, my kids are like going crazy about it. That's Old Navy. For whatever reason, Old Navy stuff like just doesn't fit me the right way. Ooh, green. Ooh, like I've never seen the color green before. It's just so beautiful. Ooh, a romper. I think rompers are my thing these days. Oh, it's motherhood. You know what? It makes me like it even more, actually. If the crotch didn't hang down to my knees, I would consider it. Okay, Ann Klein, new with tags, $50 here. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Those are all evening gowns down this way, and I was trying to vibe with Chessie, but I don't think that's gonna work out, not for $50. It's a little crazy. Ooh, I really like this one. I don't love the tie stuff that happens, but, oh, that's way too short. What am I thinking? If they have this, a little bit longer. I do like the buttons up front, but you guys couldn't even see. You guys, this is beautiful, but it's so thick. Also, not my size, but if it was, I would totally go for it. I like the ruching. I think I made it to the casual dresses now. Oh gosh, now I have to just find my size and stuff. That's the hard part. Well, if you find something that you like and then you find out, oh, it's not my size kind of a letdown every time. Actually, I love this. Yep, love that one. Neutral who, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> Do I even know myself when I enter a thrift store? I'm like, I'm gonna find X, Y, Z. And then I find the complete opposite of that. Just trying to look for the size on this dress. Isn't it darling? It's like a cute little summer dress. And then peep on this tag. It's altered state. I'm always gravitating toward their stuff, but 
Ooh, here's that purple dress I've been looking for. Fashion Nova. Hey, people say mermaid core is in. What about this one, though? This is more what I would gravitate towards. Hey, it's new with tags. This is super cute and casual. Wait, did I find a Lily Pulitzer? No, it's a knockoff. Hey, mermaid core again. Neon's totally in. Look how cute that is. I don't know if it's my size. Avelina, what, is, what does that say? Oh. Ah, it might fit me. Okay, the kids I came with, why is it so bright all of a sudden? I must have tapped the screen or something. The kids I came, there's two kids, my daughter and then a cousin. They are super hungry. Check that out, 90s style. Really like that. Oh gosh, off the hanger again. I just don't even have the patience to like put it back up. I'm trying to find, this one's super cute. Oh, it's a romper. Oh my gosh, my bum cheeks would just fly right out of that. Should I try it on anyway? What does that say? Does that say altered state again? I feel like it's super cute. Should I just try? Okay, I'll try it. Maybe I'll put it on the bottom so it'll be the last I try if I have time. But I doubt it's going to look good. Here's my loot. Looks a little ridiculous. I'm going to try some stuff on. Okay, no dressing room. So this is what we're working with. Was that a, a rip? I kind of like this. It's nice and flowy, nice and free, decent. This is Madewell. Oh my gosh, what's in the pocket? Did I just become a millionaire? Is that gold? No, I don't know what that is, a staple or something. Um, I like this and it has pockets. I don't know if it's too short. It's hard to tell. It's right above the knee. I think it's okay. This is that altered state one that I said. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna try on because it might be too big. Uh, it might be too short. <laughs> But otherwise, I love it. I don't. I have to figure out what tags are on clearance. But this is cute. No pockets though, so I don't know. This is a dress. It buttons all the way up, but I'm in a time crunch. My kids are starving, have you heard? Anyway, it has pockets. It's loft. It's super cute. It's nice and lightweight, so I think this is a win too. Might be a little long on me. Oh, and I see a little stain. Whatever, I'm gonna get stains on it anyway. Um, I think this is a yes. Love, actually. I mean, color. 10 out of 10. No pockets? Oh, zero. I'm done with it. And the slits on the side? What? What is happening? Oh, is that why it's so dang tight? Because fake shorts underneath? I feel it. I'm feeling. I'm catching the waves. Oh, and it has ties in the back. This is all kinds of no. Can confirm this is a kid size. Although I feel like I could totally rock it, but it's just, it's too high here. I love the print. It's super cute. I love this. I feel like I'm getting ready to paint a house. Where's my paintbrush? It's super comfortable. It's a jumper. Never did I think I'd see the day. How much is this crap? Eight dollars. Best eight dollars I've ever spent in my entire life. Just confirmed. Yellow, green, and blue is half off. Oh my, why do they make anything without pockets? I'm so frustrated. This is a little big for me, but so it's a pass. When, when I say a little, I mean like, come on. I mean, even like putting a button here, I guess I could do that. Hold on, let me, is it too much to finagle though? I do like the shorts, but I have leggings on under it. Am I gonna like the shorts if I don't have leggings on? I don't know, the top is a little tight in the back. If I'm already complaining about it, I'm not gonna wear it. This is super comfortable. I don't have anything like this in my collection. <laughs> and when I say collection, I'm laughing because that's ridiculous. This is um, a nicer brand. I forgot what it was, but it feels really quality. And it's just like a nice around the house piece, covers the shoulders, which I'm kind of into lately. I don't have a lot of stuff like that, but it doesn't cover the legs. So I don't know. I feel so attacked. Avelina said nay to these pants. Is she, does she know what fashion is? Seriously? I even put a white shirt on for this moment. I love it. I think they're super comfortable. The this is a yes so for me. What? The length, so the length? That's called Capri. Good news and bad news. Ooh, Avelina said yay. These are 75% off, but they, they don't like fit very well. I mean, they kind of do. It's hard because I have leggings on. No, I'm not gonna like it. It's like already coming down up front, but they're super cute, right? Nice and linen -y and airy. The buttons are fake. Like, what's the point? It's not even fashion. Nothing worse than trying on a pair of pants that don't fit you in front of a bunch of people. These are sausage casing. They're so tight, but they're really cute. Also, those I couldn't get past my ankles. 
I really like this skirt, oh, except for the fact that it doesn't have pockets. Why do they do that? It's super uh, comfortable, which is nice. So I'm into that and it's half off, I'm pretty sure. We will remember this moment because I'm not getting this. It's slightly too big and, uh, but I really like, I really like the flow of it. Maybe I'll just get it because I like it and it'll fit now for a little bit. Kind of, it kind of fits, but not really. Oh, it's three bucks. Three dollars for a skirt. All right, I'm embarrassing myself. I'm literally dripping in sweat, trying all this stuff on, uh, trying to get out of here because the kids are hungry. This, I don't know, is this too boxy? I feel like I need linen pants to like get the rest. The arms are kind of weird. I don't know, it's a, oh, it's a yellow tag. <laughs> I have about 17 of these uh, blue and white striped shirts to try on, so. What do we think? This is really pretty as like a bathing suit cover up or something, but it's super short, so it's a no for me. I really like this, but I just know that I'll never gravitate toward it. I'll never wear it. I could, oh, oh I could wear it open. Oh, revolutionary, somebody called Vogue. <laughs> so these are the linen pants that I tried on earlier. They are a few sizes too big, but like they kind of work. Kind of, I say that as I'm like pulling them up every two seconds. Um, I don't know how I feel about the like flare at the bottom. I mean, I might love them if I don't have leggings on, you know? But do they like add, accentuate? I don't know, I feel like we can do better than this, right? Wah, this is not fit me. It's not even close to fitting me. It's like not even, you guys. Can you see the back? It's not even close to fitting me. Uh, I don't know if you could have seen any of that, but someone is going to find this and absolutely adore it. It's so dang cute. Well, RIP to these. I don't think I'm gonna get them. These are the Cole Haan ones. I'm gonna regret not getting them if I don't get them. What are they, like 15 bucks? Regret costs more than $15. Should I just get them? Mm. Two bags of Barbies. I'm a Barbie girl. Look at them, they even have clothes on. It's $5 for all these dang Barbies. And a Ken doll. Are you joking? Is there a Ken. Ken doll in here? I don't think that's Ken. What? That's Ken. That's, that's, that's more Ken's like that's Ken. more like Shen. <laughs> that's Shen. That's Shaun. All right. Does Ken have a little brother? I don't remember. No. I'm home from the thrift store. I found a lot of treasures. One of my favorites was the uh, painting by what is it? Kevin Dunn or Kevin Day or Davis something. Ken. Ken. Ken Dunn. I feel like that's pretty accurate. Anyway, come to find out, he's a pretty like big artist. And back in the 90s, he was huge. I just really liked the artwork. And then I found that vintage piece. You can't even see it. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, but I love it. And then the kids found so much stuff and I found uh, clothes to add to my wardrobe. At the end there, I saw that they had all the shorts on like the very last aisle. So, oh my gosh, and that stroller breaking my dang heart. So, so many gems to be found. I will bring Eleanor back. She likes thrift store shopping, so I'll bring her back one day and maybe the stroller, it definitely won't be there. Anyway, not the stroller, the walker. Anyway, thanks so much for thrifting with me. Eventually, I'll share the haul with you. Not the whole haul because like the kids are using their stuff. Maybe I'll share what I got. Who the heck knows? You'll see it if nothing else. Anyway, thanks so much for thrifting with me. Hope you had a good time. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day. I'll see you next time. Bye.